Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Flat Top County in Transport Fever 2. Yes, okay, so, whoops, press the right buttons. So we're sitting here over at, uh, at uh, uh, Dewey and, uh, we've, and outside Davy Ridge here. Um, right, and um, we got this highway here. Uh, oh, let the time roll. Uh, that'd be good. Uh, we've got this highway comes up here and then uh, points toward Box March over here. I'm going to run the, uh, the road up this way, all the way up to uh, Box March. And I'm, I'm not sure. Um, I've got the town Box March uh, crossing here. And I, th I was thinking I'd have a road coming across through this gap. And that would head probably over toward uh, Mesa View. And then back up toward Holeville, I think. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. Uh, so, uh, what I'm going to do first of all is... Uh, uh, take um, take out some uh, roads that are inconvenient. Yeah, I'm going to rebuild this bit of road as the highway. Right? So, that just means we need to uh, get rid of it. Um... Right, okay. Uh, take this out. Uh, yeah, okay. So now, uh, this, uh, I've got to come down the uh, valley here. Uh, there's a bit of a, a slope down there. But I need to get up that way first. So, uh, we'll take the extra large country road. <clears throat> uh, get the bendy road, right? Um, build it in some segments so we get uh, less uh, uh, digging into the ground and more following the ground. And yes, straight here does seem to be a uh, appropriate um, uh, option. That, that, that's the word, option. Now, coming into... Box March. Um, yeah, I think I'll, I'll connect it up on this road. Yeah, there's no reason not to. Uh, okay, so this road can come up. Where's the... Okay, I need to connect uh, kind of like this. And then like this. No. We'll come down... Then like that. Yeah, that's marginally better, I think. Right. Okay, so that gets a, uh, a road into there. Uh, right, the, um, uh, the road coming across here is basically going to track with this. Uh, maybe. I'm going to need to, uh, to remodel the towns to uh, make them really work, but that gets the uh, road connection coming up here. Lots, way too many side roads and stuff there. Uh, where to put the crossing? Probably right about, right about here, I think. Okay, just pause it while uh, messing with this stuff. Yeah, get rid of that. Uh, get rid of this, 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 this. Right. Okay, now build the crossing. Uh, it's going to be a big road this way. Yep. Oh, no. Yeah, like that. Okay. And then this comes up just like so. Uh, 
Like that? Yeah, like that. Okay. Right. And... Uh, okay. And then this one can come up just like that. Yep. And... Okay, just take this business out here. Yep. And then the... The road. This one can head off the uh, uh, edge of the map. Okay. So let's uh, let's build that. Here we go. Uh, right. And then it can come like this. Uh, bend it around, kind of like this, I suppose. Yep. Okay. That's the end of that one. And... Right. That. Okay. Uh... And I guess... Connect this one. Yep. Connect this one. Yeah. Uh, that one doesn't need a connection, uh, that way. I can, uh, build a road out like this. And a road like that. Yeah. Okay, that gets that. So those are all connected, right? I'm going to need a... Well, what I'm going to do, I'm going to... Tools. No, I want roads. Tools. Uh, I want this bit to be owned by me. Uh, so that uh, the intersection stays free of uh, connection points. I think that'll work. Uh, right, okay. No, turn off the tools. Go for the streets. Right. Now, I need... I need a... Well, what if I make it a straight road? Yeah. Then, I could come across like this... Right? Yep. I could. Right. Okay, now you need a bendy road. Oh. Okay, that gets... Ooh, that's frightening. Right. It is frightening. Uh... You know, I really need to cut out the uh business, don't I? Where? Oh, that is the right tool. Okay, so I want that. Right. And a street. And that can come up like that. And like this. Right? Yeah. So that connects, this will connect Box March Crossing uh, with a crossing. I mean, who knew? Okay, good. Get the, uh, get the tools back. No, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's do that. Okay. Uh, no, no warnings, right? And just uh, get going. Uh, I didn't erase, no, I didn't erase all of them of any kind. So uh, let's up the tempo a bit here. 
Uh, right, target population 233, so it should start rebuilding the town. Do I want to leave the traffic light there? I don't know, maybe. Maybe. Yeah, it's probably fine. Okay, I need to also uh, update this bit of road. Okay. Come around like... No, no, I need... No, I need this one. Uh, yeah. It needs to come around like that. Uh, upgrade this bit. What? Not enough cash. Ah. Well, I can leave that where it where it is. Um, turn off the traffic light there. Don't need a traffic light there. Uh, don't need one here either. And don't need one there. Or there. Um, no, I'm going to turn it off there as well. Traffic lights don't work especially well in the game, and it's just, uh, it, because of the way the traffic works in the game, the traffic lights are basically useless. The, uh, so what happens if, if you observe the traffic, it always, it, like there's no channelization in the traffic. There's no wait for a gap before turning left and just go. There's no, you know, there's the, can I go? No. Can I go from the other way? Can I? Can I? Can I? And there's no uh, especially uh, uh, organized uh, uh, process involved in that, right? Which, uh, which uh, combined with the lack of uh, ability to uh, set lane directions uh, based on uh, expected traffic patterns and things like that, uh, and uh, no channelization and uh, traffic signal phasing and all of that, it it makes uh, it makes traffic lights basically worthless in the game and that's unfortunate because in denser traffic but not not ridiculously dense traffic it could make a huge difference in overall uh, I guess traffic functionality that's that's the word I'm looking for now that I have the highway up here up to box march crossing and onward into box march i should get the uh oh, which call it uh passenger business going up here yeah that's what i should do so i'm going to put a station down here near the junction i guess yeah station at the junction uh seems about right so that's a building yes uh, grab one of these, uh, make it maximum size, put two platforms on it. Yeah. Yeah, two platforms seems appropriate. Let's make this one a drive-through. Okay. So, uh, put it on an angle over here. Yeah, put it on an angle. Do I, though? Maybe. Um, no, I want to put it right about here, I think. Bam. Okay. Now, I want a road connection there, right? Now, streets. This will be actual streets. I need the bendy road. Uh, bring this one down. Too much slope. Why is there too much slope? Uh, I can't... Hmm. Can I come out of here? Uh, too much slope. You know what? 
I think that will work. And then I can get too much slope again. Nope, this is not going to work. Okay, so then don't do it. So I'm not going to be putting that up on the hill there, am I? No, probably not. Yeah, but up on the hill seems about right. Uh, so put it in here. Okay, how would that work? I could put it... I could put it here. Put it here where I can... Uh, well, why don't you put it there? Well, that just seems odd. So, you could put a road like that. I could. And then it tendrils over to here. What's the, the cashman's decent on it. Okay, and then you could put a regular bus stop over here. <clears throat> over here. Yeah, I could. That would, uh, that would possibly work. Uh, that's going to be Box March Crossing. No, this is going to be Box March Intercity. Yeah, Box March Intercity. Uh, get the, uh, the road business back with the tools. Uh, turn that off. And we'll take that as owned by us as well. So you know what I'm going to do now? I'm going to take this line, which needs way more buses on it. Yeah, way more. We'll manage the line and Davy Ridge transfer, Bridgeport Central, Davy Ridge. And down here to Box March. Yeah, okay. So this is going to be the uh, BRGP Box March Intercity. Yeah. Okay. Now, up here, there is a traffic jam. Okay. Well, it's pretty clear that that traffic light needs to go as does that one and i think a bus lane along here is probably important oh right no i'm going to take ownership of this 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 why? Well, the idea is that by doing so, I can keep the I can keep the towns from uh, linking onto it. Um, Right. What's uh, what's it doing? Oh, I think I need a second uh, road link up here. Uh, perhaps one here. Yeah, that might be a good idea. Tools. Right. Okay, so that'll take some of the traffic out of here. Right, which means I can take the bus lane off of that bit. Okay. So how long does it take this to clear? Oh, this is also too short. Ah. Okay. Yeah. Well, I can also solve that. Don't put a crossing on there. I see. Okay, there we go. That cleared that. Good. 
I don't think I need a bus lane there, actually. Uh, yeah, let's not put a bus lane if we don't actually need one. Yeah. Okay. That cleared most of the uh, traffic that was blocking everything. Oh, I've got a traffic light there, don't I? Yeah, I don't need one. Yeah, let that just uh, clear on its own. Right, now I need to go in here, manage vehicles. Uh, let's put nine of them on here, and so we just have a bunch of buses tooling back and forth there. Yeah, that should be, that should be fine. Okay, now there's still just enough time here to do... Uh, what would it be? Do a bus line between uh, Box March and uh, Box March Crossing. So I'm going to do that. Uh, nope, passenger. I probably want. Well, no, I probably want the. Uh, if I put it here. Yep. I probably want another one about here. Yeah, and yeah, that covers just about everything down there. And I probably want one here and here and here and probably here. Yeah, I think that'll do. Okay, the tools, yeah. Electrification. Tram track. Electrification, yep. So, tram track. I'm going to use trams here. All the way up here to here, like so. Right. It would seem like a good idea to build a depot as well. Yeah, I don't know what gave you that idea. Well, it seems like if I have a depot, I can actually get uh, trams launched. Now that uh, does seem to have some uh, likelihood. Uh, okay, so if I put it here, right, I need a street. Uh, like that. Yeah. Okay. Well, you got a street. What are you going to do with it? Uh, make it a uh, tram operation thing. Oh, it's a tram operation thing. Yeah, it's a tram operation thing. Okay. Did we get any traffic lights? On? Yeah, we got a traffic light there. Don't need it. Okay. Well, you've got the... Uh, the... You got the depot, right? So I need trams. Well, the Pittsburgh is uh, relatively fast loading. And 45. That does 40 and is faster loading. Carries 26, 21. Let's go with the ATM 4000. You know, just for something different. I'm going to put three of them. Right. New line. Okay. Here. Here. Here and here. Right. Up here to here and here. And back again. Okay. Well, that works. So this is going to be Box March Main. Yeah, Box March Main. Well, let's just hop on board this and we'll observe it. Ooh, that looks kind of nice. The landscape and everything. I do want to widen this road to the uh, four lanes to match what came in, but that's going to use more cash than I've got. But it's a mountain town. Yeah. 
And we've got the, the wider street here. Yep. Well, that, uh, that does seem to be uh, functional. Right. we got to stop there. Yep. And then there's one more after we climb the hill. Yep. At the main bus terminal. Yes. Okay. That will, that will be acceptable. Now, if I look in here, I need... Oh, just stop following, would you? You are where? You are heading to Bridgeport Central. Okay. You know what? Uh, is there a replacement? That's a ZIS-155. Is there a replacement for these that's a better uh, passenger? No, there isn't. Okay. Right. So if we go up here, do we have any coming back up the way? Um, that's a question. Uh, which way are any of you guys going? That way? They're all going back. Okay. Right. Ah, we've got a bus here. Right. No. Nope. Those are trams. Um, where are they? Oh, they're going here. Ah, you are going, nope, that's going to Bellows, and you are going, okay, you're going to Box March, okay, so we're going to pick up all 12 people there, yeah, and off we go, okay. kind of like that uh, multi-way intersection, how that came out. Need to do something with the uh, the roadsides there and everything. Okay, the suspension bridge. Actually, this is looking really nice with the taller buildings popping up beside it. I like it. Eight. And off we go for Davy Ridge. Yeah. Okay, that'll take a minute. Uh, these buses will take a while to spread out. Uh, that will probably help the. That'll probably help the. Uh, I guess queuing at the the stations. Yeah. Uh, it should help the queuing at the stations as the buses spread out. I think I might need a stack more of them on here, but they need to spread out a bit first. I think that's the important part. And because there's only three stations on here, it'll take a while before they do. Okay, now, where's the... Oh, right, we have to go through that mountain pass. Right. I forgot about that. The mountain pass. That was actually one of the the bits I was aiming for with this map, was to have uh, longer rural sec sections. So riding the vehicles gives a more uh, open, I guess. That would be the, the term, open uh, experience, right? Uh, allowing for things like... Uh, climb up to a mountain pass, uh, 
through a forest, uh, that sort of thing, right? And I think that has been accomplished, at least to some extent here. Animal. What was that, a moose? Uh, or a deer? Moose, probably. It was standing in the middle of the road. That's like truth in gaming. They do that. Yeah, I know that from actual experience. They stand in the middle of the road and get hit. Yeah. There's another animal. Yeah. Oh, we're coming on up another uh, pass here. Or, or the pass. Right. Well, that's uh, quite the hill. The bus is uh, slowing down on the... You know, down to like 49. Oh, wow. This does feel like a proper mountain road. Uh, one of the problems with the games like this is the scale is uh, warped, right? Uh, so the scale of the map and the scale of the assets and objects on it don't tend to match. So in Transport Fever, for instance, the scale of the roads and vehicles is substan substantially larger than the scale of the landscape. So when something says it's a kilometer away or a station is 800 meters long, compared to the uh, the... Uh, size of the stations and everything that's uh, and the scale of the towns and everything it's uh, huge uh, it'd be closer like 20 kilometers or something like that uh, it might not be quite that big of a difference but that that is the thing with the with this these types of games is the scale uh, uh, well, they, they don't all use one consistent scale. I definitely need more buses on here. Yeah, so we drop off a few, pick up a few. Yeah. Yeah, I definitely need more buses on here. Uh, obviously, I need a train on here, uh, ultimately. But more buses will be necessary initially. So here's the new bit of highway. See, that's what I meant about the traffic behavior at intersections, right? See, if there was uh, some sanity in the traffic operation operational rules that sort of uh, go right up to the thing that cut across the road and stop uh, behavior, that wouldn't happen. That would mean more processing power, though, and that could be a problem, right? The Also, the uh, lane usage and discipline would be a little bit better uh, also, or could be a lot better. Uh, as a commenter on a forum uh, indicated, it, it's probably a case where they uh, repurposed all of the rail uh, infrastructure for uh, routing and everything and just treat the... Uh, each lane of the road like it's a track, right? And if each lane is treated like it's a track, that explains the the behavior of the road vehicles quite, quite, uh, uh, quite well. Uh, they can only shift between lanes at a node. They, and they will stick in a lane until they get where they're going. Uh, it, it, I think there's a little bit more recalculation of paths than you get with trains, but otherwise, I'm pretty sure they just repurposed all of the uh, train uh, infrastructure with a few tweaks. Okay, here we go, up into the station. Yep. Okay, this... Oh, wow, that's a hill. Right, this is... this is working. Nice. Uh, Bridgeview now accepts food and construction materials. Yeah. 
Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay, so box march is is working. Uh, the box march. Yeah. Okay, that's all working. That's good. So let's just uh, go in here. Um, actually, I want to take a look at the line. Uh, rate 42. That's clearly not enough. I'm going to double the number of buses on here. Yeah, it's a long line, so that shouldn't be a problem. Also, if we jump in the line manager, we can see our intercity bus is doing uh, a great business. Uh, in fact, most of our, our lines here are doing a great business. Down here at the bottom, we only... Let me close that. We only have a few that are losing some money. And they're not losing that much compared to what these guys bring in. Uh, especially this uh, intercity one here that is uh, the Box March one. Uh, this one actually looks like it could probably use a few more as well. Yeah, so we'll double the number on that one as well. Uh, that gets the frequency down to under two minutes. Yep. Uh, Box March Main is definitely has enough. We've got yeah. We don't have too many really long free like long long frequency or frequency or whatever uh, time between vehicles. We don't have too many that are too particularly big there. Okay. But what this all means is uh, modulo spending money we've got we got uh, some millions coming in so that's overall quite uh, quite a good result yeah so that gets a road up to box march uh, then it's going to be mesa view uh, and sky view up here uh, i think yeah, I'll, I'll work toward getting... Uh, I'm going to get road connections out to all of this stuff. Like main passenger road connections. And uh, I, I've been thinking about it. Uh, my original plan, I don't know what it was exactly. But I'm going to get road connections out to all of these these towns. Uh, in a high and a highway network between them. And then I'm going to look at... Uh, dropping rail services and that sort of thing into it once all of the stuff is is ticking along nicely and as it stands right now I've got it ticking along nicely cash wise for road vehicle uh, construction I can do quite a lot of road vehicle road fiddling uh, with the with the uh, operations as they are currently then uh, I I wonder maybe maybe I'll uh, hmm it might be an interesting challenge to get everything operating with uh, road vehicles uh, even for the freight. Uh, now that 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 would get tedious uh, real quick, wouldn't it? Now um, yeah, I'll need to I'll need to look carefully at what's where. Uh, for instance, uh, up here we've got two coal to iron I could drop that down to the steel mill here and I could do that all with trucks and then I could truck the steel on over to the machines factory um, but then I'm down to where do I get the 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 lumber from and I don't see a lumber mill nearby right so uh, I'm gonna end. I'm gonna try and do an every producer, every consumer thing also on here. Yeah, uh, it's not gonna supply all of the demand at all of the towns. It, it it just won't. And I might dig up some mods and increase the the number of industries and all that uh, down the road. But uh, I think realistically, where it's at now is is a good starting point anyway. Yeah. Well, uh, that's that's enough uh, waffling on here.
uh, I'm going to put the the cut here. Uh, next episode should be, if I remember, uh, working on the connection from uh, Box March on through Mesa View, uh, hopefully, uh, and that will that will give uh, that will give yet another destination to uh, for the passengers, and that'll increase the uh, growth in the towns and all of that. Uh, so, so I should give a really good challenge when it comes time to build the train stations and, the, and, and everything, right? Anyway, uh, so that's going to be all for this episode. Uh, I do have, if for some reason you want to support the channel, I have a Patreon, so you can uh, head on over to the link in the description if you want to. It's kind of a tip jar, right? So if you don't want to, then don't. Um, it's not a tip jar exactly, but uh, you can you can head on over there if you want to, and if you don't want to, don't. Yeah, that's really your money, right? And I guess see you back next time.